Hello everyone and welcome to uh, How to Draw. My name is Kelpin Kingsley and today we're going to be drawing one of the uh, new Netflix uh, superheroes, I suppose you call them, set in the Marvel uh, Cinematic Universe of kind of characters and things that they've been doing. And uh, today we're going to be drawing Luke Cage. So, um, debuted in September, just barely, came out on the last day of September uh, in the world on Netflix, uh, as I said. And yeah, very interesting, very good concept. I like the way that uh, uh, kind of they seem to have found a way to make all of their Netflix shows um, kind of fix into one almost. With like, you so you've got Spider Man and Daredevil, and now Jessica Jones, and now Luke Cage's. Um, so we're going to give him his chain belt, which is very important. Uh, to draw a chain, you just draw a series of sausages like this, and then sausages on the bottom as well. Um, and then some sausages this side as well, kind of just to give the illusion of a chain, which is obviously uh, one of Luke Cage's special abilities, actually. Um, and I, oh, I don't want any comments in the uh, comments section stating the obvious. Uh, he's black. Uh, guys, stop being racist, yeah? We all know that Luke Cage is black and that with that we can you know infer things about him but that it's stereotypical and it's not funny uh, and it's not big and it's not clever uh, more importantly um, so yeah what I'm drawing now is his legs uh, and indeed his feet uh, which are kind of very nimble basically he's as I say he's one of the street heroes of Marvel um, Cinematic Universe um, very muscular and of course he has got unbreakable skin um, so I'm kind of showing that here with his arm. Essentially, it's unbreakable. Um, so here we go. And then you may have seen me draw a number of different arms in my uh, kind of tutorials. Um, I don't know how new you are to the channel, um, but we do try to do a mixture of kind of realistic um, images and images that are, you know, more comic book driven. This is absolutely one of the more realistic ones because we have to. Uh, well, we have to image it after Mike Coulter, which is of course the actor's name. Um, so just give him some fingernails there, and then some finger fingernails on the other hand, like so. And then it's time to do his uh, head, which will look something like this. Yep. Um, so who's seen it? Do let me know in the comments below, because I love interacting with you, well, with the ones of you who aren't racist at least. Um, I do yeah, appreciate your comments and your feedback. Um, I, you know, I get a lot of stupid comments on there, sure, like, oh, you can't draw, and, uh, oh, um, you've made him look deformed, and it's just completely, completely ridiculous feedback that is, that has no bearing in, in logic or, uh, or indeed, um, you know, uh, non-fiction, you know, stupid comments, like, and it's hurtful as well, I don't find them hurtful, don't get me wrong, like, I water off a duck's back, um, I know I'm great, and there's nothing you can do to uh, that would kind of make me think any other different way to that. Um, but no, no, guys, it's it's just marginally rude, and um, to be honest, it's it's off-putting to potential artists um, because they might see that kind of comment, and up there in, inevitably they'll see my um, artwork, and they'll say mine mine's not as good as that, and he's getting a load of hate comments. Oh, I'll give up. Do you think they said that to to Van Gogh? Do you think Van Gogh gave up? Um, of course, the internet wasn't around when Van Gogh was drawing, so um, probably a good thing. Sunflowers. Uh, right, so now we're drawing uh, Luke Cage's face, and he's gonna. I'm gonna give him like some big bushy eyebrows, like this, um, on both uh, sides of the face, which is traditional, really. Um, look at anyone; anyone will tell you that. Um, and then his eyes go over here like this, and then his lips and mouth will be like this. He's quite a um, quite a bold individual in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Um, so obviously he's very strong. He's got super strength, unbreakable skins. So uh, yeah, you just need to kind of draw him with the uh, kind of I suppose. Respect and you what you want to you want to make him look powerful, I guess um, so there's the basic outline just going to draw some little bands and some more chains here Just to really emphasize the, the chains 
There we go. Cool. Uh, right, so now obviously the all important colour. So we've, of course we've got to have yellow for Luke Cage. And uh, we're going to give him some purple trousers as well. Just like in the uh, Netflix show. Uh, and, it, and indeed quite similar to um, how he looks in the comic books to be honest. Um, the yellow wife beater is a, a very uh, mandatory element of Luke Cage. Um, anyone who reads comics will tell you. And in fact, um, they may get somewhat passionate about it, especially when you go, "Oh, I've only been uh, I've only been watching since the since it came out on Netflix. Oh, and then I'm going to go out and buy the graphic novel." Ridiculous. You know, you can't just hop on the bandwagon anytime you feel like it. It's just a bit stupid in my opinion. Uh, anyway, right now, of course, the all-important skin colour. I mentioned it already, but he is a black man, so we do need to um, draw him accurately with, with, you know, black skin, um, which is great. And again, no racist comments in the comments section. Uh, this is, as I say, Mike Coulter, uh, quite young in the uh, in the Netflix show, actually. Um, in the comics, he's more of an older man now. He's got a child, that is a spoiler, uh, with uh, Jessica Jones, no less. Uh, not really surprising. Certainly if you've been watching the uh, Netflix show, it looks like they have a, a bludgeoning uh, relationship. Um, so there we go, getting towards the end now, just make sure that you've coloured all the fingers uh, and the ones that go behind him like that. And then just finally, you want to add a little bit of colour in his eyes for his beautiful green eyes, just to really set him off there. So thank you very much for watching everyone. That is Luke Cage. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you've been enjoying the uh, Luke Cage Netflix series. Please do subscribe to this channel for more tutorial videos.